30, a popular South Florida rapper facing the Muse at Lauderdale courtroom today. Dyson Octave, who's better known as Kodak Black, was in front of a judge after additional charges were filed against him for violating his probation. Only Local 10's Todd Tonkin was in court for today's hearing, and he joins us live right now from Fort Lauderdale with more. Todd. Janine and Victor, a very long day in court. In fact, it's still going on. At last check, when we came down to do this live shot, a bartender who alleges that Kodak Black uh, attacked her inside of a nightclub was under cross-examination. But I have to tell you, for a young man that has been in jail since the end of February and is facing possibly more jail time, he seemed extremely relaxed in this hearing. Dyson Octave, better known as rapper Kodak Black, turned down an offer from the state of eight years in prison for an alleged battery and probation violations. As family and reps from his label Atlantic Records looked on in the courtroom, his probation officer detailed how the rap star violated his house arrest terms. He did not complete anger management. He was thrown out. He went to Ohio to the Adrian Rona fight without permission. While on house arrest, Black allegedly went to a strip joint called Club Lex, where a bartender named Jennifer Cunningham says he assaulted her. So then after he, I pushed him away, he started to actually start swinging his hands towards me like he was trying to attack me. As he was trying to attack me, I'm grabbing to defend myself his arms. I guess um, he got a little outrated with that, and then he kicked me. But under cross-examination, she admitted she didn't see a doctor for her injuries until she had retained an attorney two weeks later. She also said she emailed Kodak Black's manager, threatening to sue the rapper for monetary damages. Since being in jail after he violated his probation, the rapper's career has continued to soar. Having a top ten hit and seeing a groundswell of support from fans buying merchandise saying, Free Kodak Black. Now, if he is convicted on this battery charge, he could face some serious jail time, and he'll have to give up his youthful offender status. However, Kodak Black's attorneys and Kodak Black himself seemed extremely relaxed and didn't seem too worried about it. At the courthouse, Todd Tong, Local 10 News.